Well, hello everyone. For today's devotional, I'm going to need Jacob's help. So Jacob, you want to come and stand over here? Come on over, nice and quick. So, Jacob, we've been cooped up in the house for a while. Is there any place that you would want to go? The beach. The beach? All right. Whoa, we're at the beach. Is that cool? Okay. This is my first time at the beach. Uh, any place else you'd want to go besides where we are right now at, at home? Where else should we go? North Pole. North Pole? Okay. <sighs> okay, one more place. Where else could we go besides here? The moon. The moon? Okay. Whoa. Sit on my lap, bud. All right. So, I was thinking for today's devotional, I'm sure some of us wouldn't want to be dealing with this situation. We wouldn't want to be where we are now in the time we are. And it was reminding me of the story of Jonah. Jonah was supposed to be in Nineveh, but he wanted to be literally anywhere else. And so he went out of his way to, to go to different places where he didn't want to be. And yet, at the end of the day, Nineveh was where God wanted him, where God needed him to share the good news and do his ministry. Now, if you are feeling like you kind of have cabin fever, like you want to be getting out, being somewhere else, I want to encourage you to think that maybe God has you here for a reason. He has you right where you are with a purpose. And I'd encourage you to see that purpose, to tell people about God's love. Just as Jonah was sent to Nineveh to tell people about what, you okay? About what amazing grace and forgiveness God had for them when they repented. Maybe God has a plan and purpose for you. And maybe it's just with your family so that you can show and demonstrate God's love and grace and forgiveness to them. So wherever you are, if you'd rather be somewhere else at a different time, a different place, know that maybe God has you there for a reason. And so with that, we'll wave goodbye. Oh, wait, what's that? Is that weird? How'd that happen? Yeah. Okay, goodbye.